Learn with me how to make these Valentine's Day edition hanging bottle gift boxes. The first thing you should do is upload the file to your design program, ungroup everything, choose the models you are going to use and delete the others. Make sure you have the same number of pieces of acetate as the number of boxes you are going to cut. If you work in Cricut remember that you must select the green lines, place them in score and then attach, do the same with each piece and then send to cut. Each box fits perfectly on a letter size sheet, but if you need to cut several you can fit two pieces together on a 12 by 12 inch mat. If you are going to cut any of the pieces that have a very intricate design, it is best to first glue the acetate on those finite cuts and then proceed to make the folds. Help yourself with a tool so that the doubles are well marked. The assembly of these boxes is very simple. You just have to glue the two tabs that are thinner to the thicker one and you will have the box ready. Always help yourself with some tools, and in this case, something that helps you put pressure on the silicone so that it does not come off. I recommend you use a cardstock of at least 80 pounds or 225 grams if you are going to place something a little heavy inside the box. You can also use some cardstock that has a pre-designed pattern or you can print a pattern yourself. Just keep in mind that you must print it on both sides since the back will always be seen from the front when you finish assembling the box. The file consists of 10 different models that you can use to make these beautiful hanging boxes to decorate any type of bottle. They can be olive oil, wine, champagne. The file is available in my Etsy shop, I leave the link below in the description. You can fill them with whatever you want, chocolates, gift cards, tea bags, nuts, money, or any special gift. They are very easy to make, these three boxes only took me 10 minutes to assemble. And look how they look, ready to give to that special person 